The representative from the 19th, Representative Walsh. Thank you, Madam Speaker. This is bad policy and you should vote no for it. Um, economies are dynamic. And I think that the constant theme that you've heard in uh, some of the comments here tonight basically share that in common. Uh, economies grow dynamically, and when things are going well, they tend to go well in a compounded way. Economies also shrink dynamically. And when things are going poorly, and retail business is leaving, and jobs are leaving, they tend to do that in a compounded way. And, and what we have here in this bill is an attempt to undo a piece of tax policy that was put in place in order to create that positive dynamic. By drawing more retail business across the river into Washington, we were going to get those additional uh, transactions that were going to grow larger than the sum of any one purchase. Well, you're going to see, if this policy goes into effect, that process in reverse. And there's going to be a bigger hit dynamically than we even were anticipating. And, 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 a, and a last thought, Madam Speaker. Uh, a, a few years ago, in 2016, there was an initiative that would have done some public uh, funding of, of uh, election activities. And it was going to use this mechanism in part to, to fund uh, some of those public expenditures. And that initiative lost, uh, I don't know, by seven or eight points, uh, but, but decisively. This is not a good policy. It's not good for economic growth. And I think the people of Washington, having seen earlier versions of this idea, have rejected it. Vote no on this bill, Madam Speaker. It does no good for Washington State. Thank you. Thank you. Additional remarks.